Mankind has shone a light on the dark side of the moon. China's Chang'e 4 probe touched down inside the moon's South Pole Aitken Basin for the first time ever at 10.15 a.m. on January 3rd. As it descended down into one of the largest, deepest, and oldest craters in the solar system, cameras on board gave Chinese scientists a new perspective of the alien lunar terrain. A high-tech computer system on board the probe was used to assess the rocky landscape and select the safest possible landing site. The entire landing process was successfully executed with no intervention from ground control. The mission's success marks a landmark in human space exploration after years of hard work, dedication, and technological progress. China's first lunar probe, the Chang'e 3, landed on the near side of the moon in 2013, the same year that President Xi Jinping made a video call to three Shenzhou-10 astronauts on board the Chinese space module, the Tiangong-1. China has hailed innovative endeavors like space exploration as an important source of national prosperity. It celebrated the successful launch of its first manned spacecraft, the Shenzhou-11, in 2016. Missions like landing on the far side of the moon are more risky because it's hard to land on rugged surfaces. But solving such problems is necessary to help lay the foundation for future exploration in space. Mastering high-precision, soft landing operations could make new missions to the moon, to asteroids, and even to other planets not only possible, but commonplace. It's been 50 years since mankind first walked on the lunar surface. Today, scientists from China and around the world are using China's Chang'e 4 probe to assess water, radiation, and other lunar factors so that we may one day return.